Hello everybody, Jesse Dusty here. Welcome back to some more Mario Party 3. Last time we did Chili Waters and the Battle Royale map. Luigi basically kicked ass, but uh, yeah, some of the, the computer players kind of made some questionable decisions. But in the end, I ultimately got all the bonus stars and was able to win, so this time, we're going to go from a snowboard to a cave board. So, let's go with Dick. And we'll have Mario, uh, Peach, and I guess Valuigi. So these are basically the other four that we haven't seen yet. So let's go hard difficulty and no handicap because, well, we want it to be a fair game all the way through. Okay. Creepy Cavern. Here we go. Signing gems and slimy bugs. Yep, slimy bugs bunny. That's what it is. 20 turns as usual and all games. And there we go. I guess I could turn off bonus. That will not only uh, get rid of the bonus stars at the end of the game, that will also prevent any hidden blocks from appearing. So, yeah. Although I suppose I could do that for one of the boards. And we'll see just from a straight uh, start to end Whoever has the most stars wins. So we can probably do that for the final board. But uh, if you want it to be seen earlier, like on the next board or the board after, then let me know in the comments below if we want to go through a game with no bonuses turned on. And once again, Mario steals first place from me. This is the same number too between Daisy and Luigi. So they steal it from me and then it's the same for third and fourth. The same exact order. It's ridiculous. Okay. Wow. So basically what ends up happening is if we go with the game for no bonuses, it'll be basically a race to see who would have the most stars at the end of the 20 turns and then uh, whoever just has what they have at the end. If they don't have the most, then they lose. I think that would be a pretty interesting uh, challenge to see if you can just beat the game through normal means without any bonuses at the end and bonus hidden blocks. So. You won't have that advantage, so no one can get 20 coins, items, or stars out of the blue with the hidden blocks. So I think that will be uh, pretty interesting. But let me know down in the comments if you want it uh, maybe on the next board, or if I don't get any comments about that, then we'll just save it for the last board, which ironically, and Magic Lamp got Princess Peach. Okay. Um, ironically, with Woody Woods being the last board played in this playthrough, uh, Woody Woods is shown as one of the boards featured in Mario Party Superstars. So that'll be interesting. Uh, Spotlight Swim. Uh, I kind of forgot to update my minigame list, so I don't really remember what I've done. Alright, uh, let me see here. Um, I do have a minigame list. No, not that. Uh, minigame list 3. Okay. So I can basically see what ones I have played. So 1 vs 3, Spotlight Swim. I don't think we played this one. Catch the swimmer by shining all the searchlights on him or her at the same time. Not practice. Why do I keep hitting practice? The R button is practice in this game. 
but on the GameCube Mario Parties, L and R cycle through the uh, the rules. Um, move and dive and move searchlight, which is what I'm doing. Uh, the swimmer temporarily stops after he or she dives. Try to sign your searchlight on the swimmer at that point. So that's basically it there. Alright, um, I gotta update this as I play. Oh, we almost got him there. Right here, right here. And we got him, okay. Okay, I'm gonna do that. No. I'll do that. Um, I don't think we played River Raiders, but we have played some of these other ones, like Ridiculous Relay, Hide and Sneak, uh, Coconut Conk, we have played that. Boulder Ball, I believe we have. Mario landed on a happening space, so the Womp King has moved from one side to the other. So... Basically, if he didn't land on the happening space there, if you go up to Womp, he'll basically ask for a particular item, and if you have that item, you can give it to him and he'll move out of the way. But if you don't, you have to move on, so... The star is right here, it's not like anyone is gonna go up anyway. Uh, anything else? Boo is right there. Took is basically a board with the left and right area separated by the two skeleton key gates, so... But there is another way you can go across. Um... You have the happening spaces along the train tracks right there, or minecart tracks, because there wouldn't be a train through here. This is a cave, so there would just be uh, minecarts. But that's basically another way you can get to the other side. And, hello. Okay, I have two choices here. I could go for the reverse mushroom, which is DK's uh, favorite item in this game, believe it or not. And for some reason, he likes... He likes the boo bell, uh, he likes the Bowser Bomb in Mario Party 2, that's freaking weird. But there's also a boo bell here, so, yeah, I don't know what to think about that. Time your arrow to shoot down an item. A to shoot arrow, watch the, how, how the balloons move, then release your arrow carefully. Bobbing balloons. Ah, uh, the boo bell is right there, ah. Uh, I could get the reverse mushroom, but it's gonna be easier. I screwed that up. I mistimed it so hard. <laughs> I shot the arrow, but the boo bell one just went out of the line of sight at the last second. So I. Wow. Could have had the boo bell, so I could have stolen some coins. That's what I was gonna get because uh, basically. Um, the reverse mushroom was gonna be the hardest to get. It's possible to get it, but I don't know. Um, Rock and Raceway. Yeah, I believe we have played this one. So there we go. Um, I'm trying to check off the list of the games we have played. Okay. I was very surprised to beat the record last time as Luigi, but uh, it is possible to beat 42 seconds, but you have to time it for the second line of carrots down here because it's very easy to hit the blue, the poison carrot. Damn it. Yeah, that wasn't gonna happen. I, I could have sped up a little more and I would have been fine, but... I slowed down too much. So yeah, that was not good. I, I, not good. I still won anyway, but... 
It would have been a close finish if Mario had gotten the good carrot. Uh, uh, we haven't played that. I know we played this one, MPIQ, because we draw. We we had a draw on that one. Uh, mess, messy memory, yeah. Mario's Puzzle Party, yeah. I Shrink Risk, um, yeah, we have. Okay, uh, six, uh, the star is down there. Did Mario go, yeah, Mario went up this way too, for some reason. But yeah, we're just gonna go right. Oh, hello. Oh my, you found a hidden block. Ah, 20 coins, okay. I'll take that. Well, I've got a pretty good lead on the happenings. I mean, coin star right now, 51. But uh, I gotta win the next minigame. I can't let Peach get that minigame win, otherwise she's just gonna use the magic lamp. Although I moved before her, so I can get to the star before she does. Alright, Snowball Summit. Yeah, we have played this one. Cause I got tossed away, basically. So, yeah, that's unfortunate. Will you stop trying to hit me? I'm trying to get a big snowball. Ah, stop trying to hit me. You know what? Take it. Oh, yeah. wow. Okay. Oh, wow. What a double, double team. Will you get out of my way, people? No, don't hit me. Ha <laughs> ha. Take that. You suck. Get out of here. <laughs> okay. Um. No, 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 no. Ha 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 ha. Take that. Oh, you suck. <laughs> And see ya. Alright. What a dumbass. Okay. Yeah, we have played that one. Don't mind me, I'm just trying to update my list of the games I know we have played. Toadstool Titan? Yeah, I believe so. The beat goes on? I don't think we have on the last board. I don't remember doing it, so we haven't done that one. Uh, Curtain Call? Yes. Daisy and I tied on that one. I lost Ship Shot Challenge for sure. Cheap Cheap Chase, the very last minigame we played on the last board. And it's too hard to beat it. Alrighty, Toad Toad Toad. Well, hello. I like that. I'm gonna get that. I could have gotten the, um, uh, I could have gotten the item bag, but I, I just wanted Magic Lamp and I want to keep my coins up. I'm not gonna bury my coins uh what okay i can still get i can still get it okay that's good all right right if you want to ride on my mining car if so let's see your coins nah really got it we'll see ya ho 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 dk you made it you want to trade coins for a star yes i do why would i say no then take the star and get out of my face Woo! Alright. Where is it gonna go next? Oh, still on the right. Oh, wow. Mario can get that one easy. Peach can't. She doesn't have enough coins, but Mario, Mario doesn't either. So if I win the next minigame or Waluigi, they can't get it. Well, Peach passed it anyway, but... Well... Hmm... Is yeah, she's gonna land on a blue space and get uh, 21 coins. Yeah, she's gonna use the magic lamp next turn. I have my magic lamp, but I'm gonna save it for when I really need it. Ooh, Waluigi going for Game Guy. Uh, we've seen Game Guy twice. Yeah, we did twice on the last board. Daisy lost Game Guy's Lucky 7. I won Magic Boxes and DK is gonna play Game Guy's Sweet Surprise. 
So you have Big Chomp, which is always times two and usually the safest to go with because he usually wins 98% of the time. Whereas the little guy, depending on his numbers, it's a little hard to pinpoint when to use the little guy. Because uh, with the little guy, you have times 4, times 8, times 16, times 24, I want to say. Uh, 32, okay, no, 16, there's no 20s. So 16, 32, and 64. If you want to use him, the little guy, it'd be better to use him when he got times 4 or times 8. But 16 and above, there's like a 0, 0.00 something chance that you'll win. And it come down, comes down to luck. Water World, jump aboard a motorboat and race. The first to finish 5 laps wins. Steer and accelerate. If you, don't, if you go too fast, you won't corner well. Watch your speed. Well, that's a little pointless because you hold A for the entire, entirety of it anyway. So, I'm going to try and beat my 31 second record. Nope. You basically have to cut the corners on the inside and stay on the inside as much as possible if you want to beat 31 seconds. Which I'm sure people have done before, but I'm not one to try and get the best record in the world. Okay, Mario still can't get that. I'm gonna... what? What? At least make him pay 10 coins for it. That's ridiculous. Oh, I got a 10. Holy crap. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I don't want a red space. I'm going this way. Because screw that. Okay. Baby Bowser, oh my god. I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna go, uh, I could get a Boo Bell. But that's 15 coins. I'm gonna go with Reverse Muscle because it's an awesome item. Ah, oh, no hidden block there. Dang it. And there she goes. Of course she's gonna use that. Why not? You suck. Okay. And we have that off of power. Yeah. Peach is using the magic lamp. Why? Well, she can't be bothered to go around and get it normally like a sane human being. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we have played that one. Hyperhydrants, yeah. Picking Panic, I know we definitely played that one. Uh, okay. Ooh, Waluigi can get that one. Cause he's going right for it. Unless I can just steal it from him. But I want him to waste those 20 coins, so I want him to stay away from my coin star lead of 51. Or, no, 61 is the record. Because I won that minigame before I got the star, so. Oh, oh no. Oh no. We could have our first battle game, people. Um, Have we done crowd cover yet? For the duel? 10 coins, oh my. 
I just got a whole lot of coins right there. Peach didn't have enough? Oh, you suck. Not slap down. Oh my god. Well, I'm gonna probably lose this. Well, it's not impossible to beat it. Because in my uh, uh, minigame playthrough of this game that I did a couple years back, I beat the battle games on super hard difficulty. So it's not that hard. It just depends on when you hit the button. Slap down. Quickly press A when the flower on the revolving panel matches the big flower in the middle. Slap. Slap the face. If you slap on the wrong flower, you'll be disqualified. Make sure the flowers match. Well, you suck. It is a... Rose? Wow, you suck. Come on, everyone else do it too. Oh, you stupid. I got stuck in that leaf, but... I don't think I'm gonna get 10 coins for it. Can I get 10, at least? I got 11, okay. I'm cool. I got- I gained one coin. <laughs> and Waluigi gained 13, so now he ties me with the coin star. You stupid son of a- Not MPIQ again- oh my god. Well, we know what happens when you go through 10 questions. Uh... I read the rules, right? Yeah, I did, okay. Oh, right. I'm not gonna make as many wrong answers as I did last time. I believe that. Who is the princess of Mushroom Kingdom? Peach! Alright. In total, how many question mark spaces have the players landed on so far? It was one, but I hit the wrong fucking button. Wow. Good job. Also, I just realized I had the computer players on very hard last time. I didn't do that this time around, so... Ah, well. I guess I'll do very hard, hard, very hard, hard. How many dice blocks appear when you use a mushroom? Two. What is the current record in Water World? 31. <laughs> yeah, that's much easier to win. <laughs> so basically, five questions. So, yeah, I didn't, uh... Yeah, I'll do very hard, hard, very hard for the next board, and then hard for the following board. And then the final board will just be regular hard mode. But, uh, maybe not. I'll probably just do very hard on the last board as well, but with no bonus. So, uh, let's see. I could go back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I need a 9 or a, a 10, but I could potentially steal that star from Luigi. I mean, Waluigi. However, I'm gonna save it and go from here. Can I land on it? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh my lord, man. Uh, I'm just gonna go this way then. Uh, no. Oh, no hidden block, are you? Hello? I was really hoping for one. Because if I can go through a a board game here and get three hidden blocks, basically one for coins, one for item, and one for star, that would be pretty cool. In 20 turns, no less. So, I already got one. Mario got the one with the star, unfortunately. So we'll just have to see. Peach, what are you gonna get? She could get a reverse room, but I think she's gonna go with... 
Get out of my way. 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 Yep, there you go. So he gets a Bowser phone? That's weird. It'd be good to use it on yourself, especially since you don't have any coins. It'd be kind of stupid if you don't use it on yourself, provided you still have no coins. So. Well, there we go. Everyone has a star now. Despite the fact that Mario got his with a hidden block and got it for free. So he's a, a douchebag right there. Alright, uh, stars and coins. Well, aren't you greedy? I have no items for you. Goodbye. Wow, Waluigi. Why are you being so greedy, man? I know you're a greedy man, but I don't know about that. Alright, picture imperfect. One of my favorites. Hit the block to stop the correct parts as they appear. Try to recreate the original picture. It hit block each set of parts flashes more quickly on the screen than the previous set. The player with the most points gets coins. Really? Alright, we need to get Toad. Uh, where am I? Okay. And... Oh, well, we just got perfect. Oh, come on. Really? You stupid man. What a douche. You're not. Wow. How dare you get perfect? I demand a mulligan. And now he's beating me with five coins. Oh my god. Well, Pierce can use the Bowser phone on herself. Question is, will she do that or will she use it on player in first place? And Mario is gonna go to the other side. And take me and Peach along with- no. Peach is not here, but he's gonna take me with him. Thanks a lot, Mario, you piece of red-headed... Red hat quick. <laughs> and, oh wow. He lands on a happening space as well, so he... Gets to go back. In the meantime, I'm on the other side of the board, so thank you very much, you thinking plumber. Although that means Mario now has two happening spaces, so he is going to lead for that one. This would be the perfect place to use a reverse mushroom. So I'm going to use that. And if I get a high enough number, I can go see Boo Boo. Ha ha! All right. Big number! Yay! So basically, I can go one, two, three, four, five, six. Crap. Oh well. I guess we're gonna do a game guy mini game as well. Alrighty. Let's take that and go to the bank. Why? Well, no. There's no reason to go to the bank. It's not filled with money. Well, there's like 15, 20 coins. No, 15 coins. Well. Ooh, stars right there. I could get it. Maybe if I win the Game Guy minigame. I think we have one more uh, Game Guy minigame to do. I believe. You know what? I'm going to steal from you because you're a piece of crap. You know that? Nineteen! Yay! <laughs> If they weren't very hard, I'd probably only steal like 9, 10, 11 coins. I don't know. Excuse me for not getting up. I'm the Womp King. If you had a skeleton key, I'd move. And here we go. Alright. I'll take all of your coins because you suck. <laughs> 